Hello, hello, hello again. Ugh, so, I'm about to be either real mad or real <laughs> relieved. So, I ordered two things from Fashion File this week. One came as it should. The other, chow, I just, I mean, destroyed. Just destroyed. And uh, I actually use a uh, mail delivery service. So I just came from over there to pick up my mail and uh, mail delivery service. You know what I mean? It's a private mailbox. I just have things come here since, um, you know, my husband and I, we aren't home during the day and it's just easier to have this place. Anyways, <laughs> I'm just hoping what I want. I mean, I want both of them, but one item is definitely more sensitive than the other. So I'm hoping one that's sensitive is in this one delicate one that's more delicate than the other so i got i mean geez please okay all right we've already wasted a minute so let's just go ahead and get to the unboxing please let this be i'm gonna put this over here oh, i want to look at that right now <laughs> yes no i could wait till i got home i just want to do it now because if it's busted up I'm just going to print up the return label right now and send it back right now. But aye, aye, aye. You know what just popped in my head? What if out of the two bags, I mean boxes, this ends up being the one that's damaged? <laughs> Who knows? Okay, so it's going to open up for me. Let me see. So y'all ain't got to. Okay, well, here we go. It's opened. So as we all know, the normal fashion file box with all of its accoutrements. Please, please be the earrings. Please be the earrings. I got a, I found a pair of vintage Chanel earrings earlier this week. Oh, and they are just fabulous. And I'm hoping if they have to be in one of the two, well, they will be in one of these two boxes. I'm just hoping this will be the box that they're in. Oh, well, this will tell me right here. This one has the necklace in it. Okay. So anyways. Oh, jeez. Well, okay. We don't have anything to worry about yet. I could always... Uh, anyways. So she saw it. It's a nice LV necklace I saw. So I'm going to open this bad boy up. And as you know, it always comes with this certificate of authenticity. And it's two things. Um, it's just something for you to keep in your, you know, in your, uh, I keep all of mine. So if for some reason in the future I, I sell anything, and actually this has come in handy. I have sold a couple of things that ended up not working out for me. Um, I tell them that, oh yeah, I purchased some fashion file. I still have the certificate and it just helps smooth the, um, buying process so there we go Jeez Louise okay so fashion file and let's see if this is as beautiful as I saw online <gasps> it is it is oh I love it oh I love it no oops sorry about the ash y'all oh my goodness I love it I um I have a pair of nanogram earrings and and they're silver and this is gonna this is gonna work perfectly oh my gosh so yeah it's a I think it's supposed to be 22 inches so it's not a super long necklace but it's gonna work perfectly with my nanogram earrings oh I love it let me see if you can get a little close up oh I love it I love it I love it there's no issues no, I don't see any issues oh this is just beautiful oh I love it let me see if it just goes over my head Oops, sure doesn't okay <laughs> it's not long enough or wide enough to go over my head but oh look at this isn't this interesting the clip I don't know if this is gonna clear up but the clip for it oh my nails Ooh, isn't that cool so then that way if for some reason, you know, the necklace shifts, 
it really is hard to tell that that's where, you know, that's where the uh, clasp is. I like that. Oh yeah, I like that a lot. Look at that. I like that. So if you know what I mean? The clasp here, it's not, it, it's not very noticeable. So for any reason, like your necklace slips around on your neck and the clasp ends up, the clasp ends up at the bottom, really, I mean, it's not all that noticeable. Oh, I like that attention to detail. All right, now Louis Vuitton. Okay. All right, now the inevitable. Lower. Oh, okay. This. Jeez. Oh. After finding this fabulous pair of vintage Chanel earrings and to find the box come like this. And the, 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 the store my store told me that they made sure that the delivery driver noted that the package arrived in this condition so if for some reason whatever's inside is broken neither my um, mail place nor I will be responsible for the damage Ugh. this is what I mean I love both pieces don't get me wrong but this is really what I was hoping. I've been looking forward to getting this piece. Oh, look, one, but open. It's so damaged. Oh, oh look at this. How did it? I mean, no, how? Just, I mean, what happened? Shit happens. <laughs> I mean, I already know what it is, but. Yeah, and you just, geez, Louise, I'm just hoping that I know what it is. Okay. Fingers crossed, y'all. Fingers crossed. So, used is the new new. I need to say busted is the new new. <laughs> oh my gosh. Okay. Here we go. Fashion file. And this good old knotted up fitness here this open oh, Lord. It's so funny I keep saying oh lord I'm not even Christian but you know when you grow up um my mom's side of the family they're Christian and that was an exclamation ooh child oh lord used interchangeably <laughs> so here's fashion final oh did it come with the box I don't remember that part let me just get rid of it about that. Ooh, don't look at that down there. Yeah, this is our little around town car. Doesn't mean we can't keep it, keep it cleaner, but that oil spill's been down there for years. It's not getting any better. Okay. So, here we go. Pearl CC dangle clip earrings. And it did come with a box. Okay. I mean, the box looks like it's in great condition. So that's a good sign. Oh, okay. One, two, three. Oops. Oh, I'm thinking it's going on three. <gasps> Are they okay? Are they okay? <gasps> no, they're not. Damn it. Oh, no. Oh, no. Look how beautiful. Look how beautiful these are. Oh no, look at this. And this, it definitely wasn't like this. Obviously it wasn't like this. Fashion file wouldn't sell. Look at that. Oh no. I was so looking forward to getting these earrings. Oh no. I mean, that's just a total bummer. Oh, look at these. These are so cute. Oh, I mean, how could the box be okay, but these be destroyed? I mean, I guess, I don't know what happened. Maybe the amount of shaking. Look at that. It even chipped off some of the, look at that. Yeah, look, see, it wasn't like that online. So shipping caused this damage. Isn't this about a blip? 
Oh, well. There, I mean, it is what it is. Yeah, look. 1996. Comes with, it still had the original little, you know, tag. 96A, I guess. Oh, this is so disappointing. Look how cute these are. Oh, gosh. Look how cute. Oh, these are going to be such cute earrings. Oh, such a bummer. Let me see if it shows on the back. Yeah, it sure does. See? 96A. This is, just sucks. Oh, well. I mean, I knew there was that possibility. Just awful. Just awful. Let me take a couple pictures so they can see that. Oh, look at that. Just chipped off in the box. Look at that. Just awful. Oh, well. I mean, what can you expect? This is what the box looked like. Golly. Just awful. I'm so bummed right now. Sorry. Okay. There, this is the end of it. There's, there's nothing else. This, I mean, yeah, screwed. Beautiful pair of vintage Chanel earrings destroyed. These will be going back, obviously. Maybe they can fix them or maybe they'll just, I'm sure they'll just do something to glue the stone back in. But the damage, the chip, that's definitely going to affect the value too. Unless someone can fix it, I can't. So anyways, y'all, <laughs> unboxing fail, 50-50, I guess. Maybe not a complete fail because I do love my necklace. All right, until next time, bye.